The White House has also issued an urgent plea to Congress warning that Ukraine's forces are running out of time and money. Senior Congressional Correspondent Rachel Scott is tracking that story. Good morning, Rachel. George, good morning. And this is an urgent and blunt message from the White House to congressional leaders warning they are out of money and nearly out of time to provide additional aid to Ukraine. But right now, there is no clear path forward and the pressure is on. In just a few hours, Ukrainian President Zelensky will address senators virtually behind closed doors. He will make yet another personal plea for more support. But lawmakers have been at a stalemate here for weeks. Republicans say they will not provide additional aid to Ukraine unless Democrats agree to crack down on the border. And talks on that issue are not going well. Senate negotiations over a possible border package suddenly broke down over the weekend. House Speaker Mike Johnson is now accusing the Biden administration of failing to address their concerns about strategy and accountability for Ukraine. Both sides are still at the table, but the White House here is clearly worried that these negotiations are going to drag on for far too long. They insist that any delay in funding would kneecap Ukraine on the battlefield. They say this is not a problem for next year, that Congress must act now, Michael. Yeah, a lot of problems there, Rachel. Thank you so much for that. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.